Hey guys, so I lost the intro to this video, but hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Please subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet. So, for this video, we are starting off with some length check. Yay, and a happy hair dance. <laughs> so, to start with this hairstyle, you're going to need a reptile comb. And you're just going to part your, your hair from ear to ear. Just like that. And I've already wet my hair and I did moisturize it before starting with this video. So my hair is fully moisturized and clean. As you know, we do not work with the dry hair. So make sure that your hair is hydrated and moisturized before starting with any hairstyle. So when you're done with that section, you just take your head tie and tie the front section of your hair and we're going to work on the back part. So for the back part, I'm just going to take my comb, reptile comb, and I'm going to put a line horizontally and I'm going to start doing a flat twist. If you can't do flat twist, then I'm so sorry this video is well it is for you because you can also do <laughs> you can also do a uh, bin and betty i'm sure everyone can do bin and betty um yeah so you can do that and you can do just any 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 kind of uh plating here because no one is going to see this so you can do anything as long as your hair is covered and protected yeah so we're just going to do that um as you can see i'm not even worried about the lines because no one is going to see this like, no and this is gonna go underneath the whole hairstyle or whatever so no one is going to see this that's why i'm not even worried about the lines whether they're clean or straight or what you know i'm busy on my zkt lines so <laughs> yeah So I just continued braiding my hair until I was done and then I'm gonna use the darling afro um, this is how it looks um, yeah I don't I throw away the pack as I'm doing the, the voiceover so I can't read exactly what is written but I'll look for a picture and insert it so you just take one strand and unravel it just like that and then you're gonna part it into half yeah i'm going to part it okay well sorry so you are going to part it into two and then you take one half and part it into two again so in one strand you should have four four um strands you know divided so you're going to crochet just like that i think you guys already know how to crochet if you watch my previous videos but if you don't know just continue watching i will not explain because uh, i'm not good in explaining so yeah continue watching Okay, so I know I said um, in one strand I divided into two 
into four but i ended up dividing it into eight so you i just parted it in, i just parted it in half and then i one half i divided it into four each so i ended up having eight so yeah i just wanted to tell you that because i saw that if i use uh four if i divide it into four i'm gonna end up uh needing more hair so that's why i divided into eight so that um my head gets fuller faster you know so yeah Okay, so now for the front part, I took three strands of the afro and I divided each one into half so that it just unravels and just to activate the afro or whatever so that it becomes like this as you see it. <laughs> okay, and then i don't think i should explain this part you guys are just going to see what i'm doing i will Okay, so I'm using the black freeze gel um, to, to just lay the front part and also to do my edges. And guys, the black freeze gel is a babe. It is the babe it thinks it is. Look at it. Can you see what it's doing already? I only use it to do my edges, but today I was just like, let me just try and lay my hair with it just look i'm tired i'm tired 